Hi guys, as you can see on the intro video. Today I will show you how to control Servo Moto through Raspberry Pi by Wi-Fi in PC. To get the program work we need two application, one in Raspberry Pi as server and one in PC as client. Firstly in Raspberry we need two program one for motor control and one for Wi-Fi communication. In the motor control program firstly is default value defined for servo motor. After that we need to have a method to initial the servo motor. Here we need setup pin 11 as servo motor control PWM and frequency is 50 Hz. Then we start servo with duty cycle is 2% mean 0.4 millisecond. Next, we create a servo control method, one is increase duty cycle and one is decrease duty cycle. In servo up method we plus 2.5 for each time activated. And in case it's over 12.5 the duty cycle will keep as max value. Then in servo down method we minus 2.5 for each time activated. And in case it's lower than 2.5 the duty cycle will keep as min value. Move to Wi-Fi TCP communication program. We need to call servo motor program here, then call the first setup. After that is TCP IP communication initialization. Remind that the port we input here should same in client port. Host we keep empty mean all client can have communicate with the server. Finally is we will wait till get connection from client, then print out client address. Inside next while loop we will check data receiving content, if there are no data will stop loop. As you can see here we have array data control command, it defined content up and down. If data content is up we will active servo duty increase method which we defined in servo moto program. If data content is down we will active servo duty decrease method which we defined in servo moto program. two program files we need to keep in same folder. Now, move to client program. We need create a form include IP address text box host port text box, connection button, and two control button. Firstly to connect the server we need to use socket library and initial it. IP and host need same as Raspberry server configured.
Now we try to test the connection between server and client. Finally move to controller method, we create a function to send byte data to server. After that by click 2 button we can send command to server for motor controlling. Thanks for you watching. Subscribe to support the channel.